Welcome back trainers and in this video we're going to be going over some new assets that have been found in a data mine. We got Reggie Ilecki and Reggie Drago. Oh my goodness, these designs are just hitting top tier. As well as Cleaver, which is going to be an alternate evolution to Scyther. So if you do have some of those lying around, you may want to hold on to them. We're going to go over that towards the end. Now let's go ahead and go over their stats and then their potential moves just to see what we have going on if you do enjoy these types of news videos give it a thumbs up so reggie drago is going to be a pure dragon max cp 3361 attack 202 defense 101 and stamina 400 all right all right so this one is looking pretty tanky yeah the defense is on the lower end but it's got a lot of stamina so we're going to be looking at an ultra beast type dragon-esque thing going on here now let's see what, what kind of moves that they do have lined up for it for here. These are all subject to change and we're gonna take a look at all their moves. So for the quick move, we have unfortunately just Bite here. Oh, we're off to a horrible start. That's not gonna be looking good for it. Bite, Hyper Beam, Outrage, and Dragon Pulse. This is looking like a complete garbage Pokemon. Okay, sure it can do something out here, uh, but it's a pure Dragon type with Bite. So as far as this move set is concerned, as of now, it's not looking too good. Let's just hope that they update that because uh, it's not looking good. But on the other hand, Reggie Ilecki is looking pretty good and it is going to be right in front of Zarud. So it is kind of uh, bringing out these Pokemon and then look at what we have down the line. Oh boy, get excited for that. All right, so this one is going to be a pure electric type with a max CP of 3,169, attack 250, defense 225 and then stamina 190 so this one's going to be a little bit more rounded as far as the stats are concerned not as bulky but it's got a little bit more defense and uh attacks looking pretty aight it's looking aight <laughs> okay so beer electric type this design is kind of ridiculous looking to me so we have lock on and thunder shock okay it's, it's already a massive upgrade for the charge moves we have thunder hyper beam and zap cannon well that turns south really quick okay <laughs> Lock on and Thundershock was looking great, and then Thunder Hyper Beam, Zap Cannon, my gosh. Sure, you're going to be charging up all of these moves really fast, so it's just a nuke Pokemon. So, again, as it is right now, I'm not looking too hot. Now, let's go ahead and look at Reggie Drago, which is basically a Charizard head, right? Look at that, it's Charizard. Uh, am I blind or something? Okay. So, for the moves, let's go ahead and see. We got Twister, Vice Grip, Bite, Ancient Power, Dragon Breath, Crunch, Dragon Claw, Hammer Arm, Dragon Dance, well that's not even a move, but again you gotta remember Lock On, that's not a move that does damage in the main series games, but they made it so it generates energy really fast and does slight damage, so a lot of these can transform into that. Um, where are we at here? We've got Thrash, okay, Hyper Beam, blah blah blah. Uh, let's see, Take Down, Protect, okay. Fire Fang, Thunder Fang, Ice Fang, what is with the moves that it currently has? Okay, if it sticks with those, then gee, oh my gosh, that's so horrible. You better believe they're going to come out with it another time where it's going to have a new move, and then another time where it's shiny, and then another time where you can, you know. Uh, moving down here. Okay, okay. Let's stay on topic. Dragon Claw again. Okay, Crunch, Dragon Pulse, Earth Power, Earthquake, Giga Impact, Outrage, Hyper Beam, Draco Meteor, Terra Blast. Terra Blast is not in the game yet. Uh, so could this be like a raid day? Yeah, it, it, it could totally see it being some sort of a raid day in which they just automatically introduce their shinies. Uh, just throwing random guesses out here from what we've seen in the past for newer Pokemon introduced from other generations that are kind of off from, you know, the typical norm on how would you release that? Well, you know, Hisui and Avalok, right? There's just a slight example. Moving it on to Reggie Ilecki. Sounds like the other Pokemon, right? So let's see what it has going on here. Although it's looking pretty good. As far as the quick moves, charge moves, not so much. Thundershock, we already seen that. Okay, Ancient Power. Uh, Shock Wave. Thunder Wave is not actually dealing damage in the game. Extreme Speed. Uh, Thunder Cage. There's a lot of new moves that I'm not quite familiar with. Thunderbolt. There's another charge move that they could potentially gave it. Uh, Zab Cannon, we've seen that. Hyper Beam and Explosion. So explosion is essentially just like a kamikaze move. <laughs> You're giving up your Pokemon to take down there. And could you imagine if they came out with a move like that? Well, essentially just bring them down to like 10 HP or maybe just KO them, but it KOs your Pokemon too. Sounds like there can be a lot of exploits for that. Ah, ah, ah. Oh my goodness, I can already see it now. People are, I just bring it in the, look, this is why I don't like going over too many ideas because, you know, I could just slip it out in a simple sentence and then it turns into a whole video for somebody else. All right, moving it on here. What do we got? 
take down okay no, okay no charge beam and uh, no we don't really need that it's great quick great great quick moves already volt switch yeah body slam there we go there's something else as far as a charge move is concerned uh and thunderbolt wild charge there you go there you go there you go wild charge you got thunder you get impact and terror blast so i mean hey they can make it work but as far as the charge moves that they do have as of now if they do get released like that <laughs> this one's probably going to be putting in work more so than the reggie drago um and speaking of them their, their names are kind of silly the designs are when i first saw them i was i just rolled my eyes like <laughs> the dragon one i like the the charizard head on it that's pretty much it they're just kind of silly this one really looks kind of silly but uh there you go there are the the, the moves all right, Cleaver, we have Quick Attack, Fury Cutter, Furry Swipes, Take Down, Double Team, yep, 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 anything else good, Rock Slide, uh, X Scissor, okay, interesting stuff here that could make Sword Dance raise your attack by two stages. Now, I feel like we're going to get a Raid Day with Stone Axe, I don't know, I don't know, is that like exclusive to it? Probably, yeah, so I, I could just see it being that, another shiny, same with all the Regis that we're just talking about. Counter, are you kidding me? I hope they give it counter. Anything that gets counter, even if you don't get stabbed, it just turns into essentially a really good Pokemon somehow, some way. All right, what do we got here? Struggle Bug, yeah, that's a horrible move. We don't need anything to do with that. Some newer moves that have not been introduced yet. Aerial Ace, Rock Tomb, Fury Cutter, and Brick Break. I mean, it's looking like a decent lineup here. Could be a cool Pokemon. This is, in fact, going to be a Bug and Rock type, okay? Uh, and it is going to be Hasuian. It doesn't have any hands. The only hands it does have are going to be those axes. Talk about a friendly guy here. All right. <laughs> the design's okay. It reminds me of something that you would see in some sort of like a World of Warcraft or some medieval times or something like that, you know, like a goblin or something. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Don't mind it at all. It's actually interesting. So, yeah, this one's looking okay, I suppose. All right, it's got some decent moves lined up here for it. But, uh, again, you want to make sure you have some of these Scythers lying around because unlike the other Regis, those candies aren't going to transfer from what you got. You're just going to have to get new ones. This one, on the other hand, is going to be Scyther candy, so make sure you have those. Some random news here. This is just a Team Go Rocket logo. Apparently, you're going to be teaming up with them. We, ha, 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 because I'm going to be there. We are going to be teaming up with uh, Team Rocket to do something. So it should be interesting. We'll have to see what that's going to detail in the future. But uh, take a look at my site. There's here as we do close out the video. So hopefully you did stick around to the end because I got a little tip for you. Hopefully you have a shadow scyther so you can evolve one into a shadow cleaver, which is going to be kind of rare. Also a shiny as well. If they don't just release it as a raid day, then you'll have yourself something pretty interesting on your hands. And of course, you want 100. I don't know how good it's going to perform. If it gets countered, it's got someplace, somewhere, somehow. So we'll have to see how it does perform here. But I'm ready to go. Hopefully, you are too. And I got this nice shadow looking great. If you did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. And I'll be catching you all next time. Take care, traders. Where you can't, don't. Even if everyone is telling you that something wrong is
something right, even if the whole world is telling you to move, it is your duty to plant yourself like a tree, look them in the eye and say no, you move.